Cameron Street below the bridge, as you can see, is now back open. Mulberry Street Bridge itself will remain closed throughout the night. PennDOT wants to bring in engineers tomorrow during the daylight. Take a look at it. The good news throughout all of this is that nobody was hurt. Some neighbors felt it. I'm not going in until someone says it's safe to go inside. Others heard it. And we all asked, what was that? And so we all went running outside to see this big cloud of smoke. And still others saw it. And they witnessed uh, a car uh, cascading down off of the uh, parking lot from the McFarland Press Building. About four stories of retaining wall and a good chunk of parking lot came crashing down near the Mulberry Street Bridge. Live human scent dogs confirmed no one was hurt. We are um, fairly certain that we had nobody uh, in the collapse. Uh, the, the dogs were kind of that, that extra added security for us. Officials say the next step is keeping it that way. We know the rain is going to uh, play a part in this and is going to create some issues, but we know that everybody's out of the area and we're not going to allow anybody back in so that we don't have to come back out tomorrow and rescue anybody. Eight apartments were evacuated because of the collapse. Officials say all those people have found places to stay for the night. Police will also be on scene throughout the night, making sure no one goes near the dangerous area. Reporting in Harrisburg, Justin Betty, News 8.